Hello Lunar Child and welcome now to Monday. Well, cloudy, irritable, and highly guarded. Chance of light showers actually. Your home planet, the moon, is in Aquarius today. That puts your emotional focus on your boundary consciousness. That is, you are emotional about where you draw lines. And this can play out all sorts of ways. This could just be that you feel vulnerable and you retreat into that crab shell, sidestep out of there. Could mean that you're randy, you want to connect to people, you're feeling like connecting. It can really uh, light cast in many ways, but be conscious of that you are oversensitive to boundaries. It could make you irritable. This is one of those days where you just don't like people maybe in your space even. It's kind of how it goes. Zimini the Sun, we are in chapter one of Sun and Gemini, and this may be also adding further agitation. Over the weekend, we shifted from, uh, of course, Taurus into Gemini. That's a shift in our state of awareness focus. In the last 30 days, Cancer is focused on their place in society and your context consciousness. This next 30 days, you're going to focus on your meta consciousness, which is popularly known as your subconsciousness, right? This is the consciousness where we store our weeds in our soul garden. But I want to start changing things a little bit with the way I teach. I don't think we should call this our subconscious anymore. I think it is our meta consciousness. When you were remembering your past life, you were going up to remember. When you were remembering your childhood, you're actually going up to remember. Everything is stored up, meta, high, attic. And this consciousness is the ceiling between us and God consciousness. This is the mucous membrane to the other side. And so this is our potential for faith. This is our potential for past life memory. This is our potential for weeds or soulmates from the past to fall right in. This is where we approach our life from a multi-lifetime perspective, which is in our subconscious. So, this month it's time for you to clear out your weeds, basically. We need to get rid of anything that's in the way, which would be subconscious, self-sabotaging behavior, or metaconscious sabotaging behavior. We get rid of those, we work on connecting to your higher self this month, and we work on downloading faith, your connection, and your knowing that everything will be okay. So, it's a little bit of a grouchy month, but it is always what happens right before our birthday. We clear out the attic. Now, that said, we do post this video on the mothership in the Cancer Zodiac Club. So if you want to watch this again and remember what this month is about, you can always go back to the mothership. It's one of the things we do. And tomorrow when we come back, we're going to get started on clearing out that attic, Cancer. So until then, live, love, be. So